a very good afternoon December 26th Sunday in Holland Tweede Kerstdag, second Christmas day Two thirty in the afternoon we had my parents home we had well the lunch it is with breads other kinds of croissants special bread really nice and I thought to myself before evening dinner let's head out and go into the city of Appingedam This cold is below zero, it's two below zero, but it does feel a little colder. About seven below zero because, well, that's a dirty car. Um, there's a little bit of wind. And that always makes for a bit of a temperature that does feel a little lower. And temperatures I was calling out is in Celsius, not in Fahrenheit. Wearing a hat, gloves, and a winter jacket, and trying to keep warm. <laughs> that is a tough task to do. Let's go here in the Gerrit Raabs, where it all closed off. You know why? Because these houses are uh, on the nomination to be torn down. Which is, well, necessary, but otherwise, well, it's all empty, no people are living here, except for two. A while ago, local company who provides electricity thought to themselves, let's cut off the power to the streetlights. And then the <laughs> people who still live there, they, uh, had to live in darkness, not in the home, they still had power, but street lights were switched off. Somehow communication broke down and the power company was not informed that there was still living two people at the neighborhood. <laughs> well, like I said, luckily they have power to the home, so they could run their central heater system and also I could see something in the dark headwind oh it's freezing headwind man wow oh christ C -c 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 cold good news next week temperatures will be rising again Let's wait for the crossing. I have going to have a look at some places here in Happingedam. Currently on the again on the Jan Bronsweg. Ahead of me the Solver de Brug. To my left and ride the dumpster deep which I showed you in another video Just the code. The code, the code. Let's go this way. This area where my dentist used to be, they moved over to another spot in the city in the town of Appingedam. But used to be here somewhere. Let's take a left turn, not this one, but one further on. Let's see how these things are going. Yeah. 
probably looks like a building site. I think there's planning or already in progress schools. Oh, a lot of water. Frozen water. Don't go on there, don't slip. You won't have started tires. Well, actually, they have started already and they almost completed a school building here. Wow, that goes fast. Used to be the area here somewhere where the elderly home was. That's been torn down. There was an apartment building that's torn down. That was an apartment building for the nurses who attended to the elderly and they could be staying overnight in that big apartment building. It's gone! Gone, gone, gone. Well, there's a little trip to here and then continue. Whew, code, code, code. Code, code, code. Let's go this way on the salted bike lane. Big chance that in the late afternoon or the early late evening maybe we will black have black ice. That will be bad. Because then you don't want to be outside on a bike walking or with a car. But especially bikes in on two legs. It will get very slippery. To my left, Solver der Staten. Apartment buildings consisting of, well, 12 or so apartments, I think. Three story building. On the back side, also apartments. So, three in the front, three on the left of the front, and three at the back, and the other back authors, 3 or 12 in total. I do not know what street it is, probably the Stationsweg, but it could be horribly mistaken. I do know the street names in the city of Groningen where I live a little bit better. Let's see if I can see a, find a street name sign. Let's have a look. Probably at a, a tree crossing there will be a sign, I hope. Or maybe on the buildings. No, nope, not on the buildings. Let me have a look. Stationsweg is to my right. Koning Innerstraat is to my left. Let's go there. Nice sunshine that is always helpful, keeping a little bit warmer. By the way, I did charge my bike, uh, my camera overnight. Yesterday I was filming and the battery was not charged fully and it cut off. So it ended really strange. I did not miss that much footage. Two or three minutes, so that was not horrible.
Want toe Bolwerk, Koningstraat is about here and then a little this way Bolwerk starts. De Vierde Nieuwstraat, let's go there and have a turn around. The building in front of me is a bakery, it's to be a bakery. Let's go and line up a bit more. Bakery, well, as you can see, it's quite dilapidated. There's a welcome sign on the door, but being in that state, you don't feel welcome anymore. Let's go this way. There used to be a butcher shop here. And let's have a look at this building. It used to be a cafe, but it's well not in good order anymore. Look at it, windows are smashed in. Part of the roof is off. It's going to be demolished. And I think they will go in the build apartment buildings there. Let's for the sake of it have a small look on the back side. Also windows are smashed out. Oh man. Terrible. It used to be a and have it 1985, 1990s a blossoming cafe. Oh the roof is also off, the roof tiles. Oh man, this looks like a horror home. Bought it up. Wow. Probably this is a dead end, but we will find out in a minute. Or is it a dead end? Or is it? It's certainly not a dead end. Quickly check if the camera is working. Cold temperatures. Just shorten the battery life. Should be okay, but check. Check, double check. Get up a bridge, Jukverderbrug. I built in 1985-86 or so. When I used to be living in Lapigram, I went to school and I, this bridge was on my route. I frequently visited it when it was constructed. Molenhorn. To my left, a parking lot, and behind that, a canal dumpster deep. And behind that, <laughs> the dilapidated building I showed you earlier. Oh my god. Man, most of the roof is gone. Gee. Let's go and go further on. Phew. Straight here. Yeah, 
uh, to my right that used to be a local HEMA store shopping mall center thing or a boarded up house and then crossing the road into the Dijkstraat which is normally the busy, well, shopping center and it's all closed up of course because it's the second day of Christmas and businesses are closed at least in this area oh, getting a cold face wow Nice Christmas tree at every lamppost. At the end of the street, I will uh, no, I go straight again, and then I then I will make a U-turn and go back here and show you more of it. Older home to my left used to be a school here where now the shopping thing co-op is C double O P this used to be also a school with our apartments the schakel the schakel is like in the chain the connection or chain somebody say it was walking coat coat huh well, indeed it is cold cold and empty here let's take a turn onto here onto this small alley and getting onto the bridge here Small, 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 narrow bridge. Got to look through here. And also to the other side. 